Hatch reported coming open at 109 hours, 8 minutes, 5 seconds. Okay, my wind is clear. I'm going to go to... I might cool it up a little bit. Okay, my wind is clear. Hey, you hooked up there? Boom. Okay, now we need to hook this. Yep, yeah, move that up there. Look at your back is uh, up against the third. Now you're clear. A little bit toward me. Yep. Stay down. Your left a little bit. My knee room. Keep your left foot uh, to the right a little bit. Okay, that's good. How am I doing? You're doing fine. Okay, Houston, I'm on the porch. Roger, Neil. Houston, uh, this is Neil, radio check. Neil, this is Houston, loud and clear. Break, break, buzz, this is Houston. Uh, radio check and verify TV circuit breaker in. Roger, TV circuit breaker's in. And, and we're getting a picture on the TV. Okay, Neil, we can see you coming down the ladder now. I'm uh, at the foot of the ladder. The lamp foot pads are only uh, uh, depressed in the surface about uh, one or two inches. Although the surface appears to be uh, very, very fine grained as you get close to it. It's almost like a powder. Down there. Uh, it's very fine. Yeah, I'm going to step off the limb now. That's one small step for man. One giant leap for mankind. As the uh, lamp foot pads are fine and powdery, I can pick it up loosely with my toe. Okay, you're good. Like uh, powdered charcoal to the small uh, fraction of an inch, maybe an eighth of an inch, but I can see the footprints of my uh, boots and the treads. Beginning of the new epic, because the television camera works perfectly. It cost a quarter million dollars. For the impact of the ghostly picture makes Armstrong's first enraptured descriptions those of every man. It has a dark beauty all its own. It's uh, like much of the high desert of the uh, United States. It's uh, different, but it's very pretty out here. Armstrong's first steps are tentative. But he is man. And he is then with his environment. And in only a few minutes, he's striding in great lunar leaps across the surface. And watching, Buzz Aldrin is itching to get down. Armstrong guides him down the ladder. Another inch. Hey, you got it? Yeah, I got it. Okay, let's step. Let's step. What a great foot. Beautiful. Isn't that something? Magnificent sight out here. Magnificent desolation. Now the two moon men set about their chores. First among them, to unveil a plaque on the leg of the lunar module landing stage. For those who haven't uh, read the plaque, uh, we'll read the plaque that's on the front of the plaque.
TRT 1 
Night Groove ist die Radiosendung vom Groove Magazin und wir feiern das zehnjährige Bestehen vom Groove Magazin live aus dem U300, nee, U60, 311. Noch eine Stunde, also bis 6 Uhr, ist Heiko Lauchs vom Kanzleramt Label live im Mix.
Stimmung noch in Ordnung. Live vom U60 311 in Frankfurt. Die 10. Geburtstagsfeier vom Rufmagazin geht jetzt auch hier zu Ende. Zumindest on air. Off air geht es hier noch weiter. Im U60, im MTW und im Robert Johnson. Da könnt ihr noch hingehen. Die Stimmung ist noch ziemlich gut. Zum Beispiel äh, Richard Barz wird jetzt in wenigen Minuten hier sein Live-Set anfangen und um 7 Uhr kommt DJ Hell und wird die Nacht zum Tage rocken. Das wird er uns versprechen und das werde ich euch versprechen. Mein Name ist Christian Sprenger und wir hören uns am 24.12. Das nennt man Weihnachten. Ich wünsche euch eine gute Nacht und eine schöne Woche. Tschüss!